today we are going to tour southern hills community this is southern hills at craig ranch by austin woods uh, this is at uh, mckinney texas very close to the uh, texas 121 if you if you see from texas 121 in uh, uh, custer uh, you can see this community southern hills at craig ranch uh, this is a part of the entire uh, uh, Craig Ranch community. So, all the people in this community can also use the um, Craig Ranch gym and other utilities. So, total Craig Ranch is uh, 2200 acres project. Uh, out of that, there are multiple communities are there. This community, you can see the gate, but I don't see anybody was staying. So, it's kind of, you know, non-gated community. So roads are pretty wide and uh, this community have a very decent uh, 100 to 150 homes. I see a very good uh, uh, parking lots and you know the um, community have a very good uh, walking trials. But the, but the thing is this community doesn't have any gym or no swimming pool and no community hall in it but of course you can use the Craig Ranch uh, community hall and other things so here the main builder is uh, Austin Woods there are already a lot of homes already constructed uh, here there are a couple of homes still available And uh, some of the, this comes into Meccani ISD as well as some of the schools comes into Frisco ISD. So, majority of the homes comes under uh, uh, Meccani High School. Uh, this is 1.25 miles from this community. And the uh, Fabulan Middle School, that is 2.4 miles, grade 6 to 8. And uh, Malvern Elementary School, it is uh, 0 0.6 miles. I think for elementary school you don't get the bus. You see here lots of uh, empty lots are available. You can see in the um, right side there is a very big walking trail and a small park is also there. You can see here it's a very good walking trials are there. So the main builder here is the uh, Austin Woods. Uh, total it is 47 acres of uh, uh, community. And uh, it have a very good access to 121. Just around 0.5 miles, you will you will get into Texas 121. So they have a multiple plans. So you can get 3,500 square feet to 2,500 to 3,500 square feet. But what I have noticed is most of them have a, a back garage. So right now I'm showing it to you. You see that uh, the flyover that is Texas 121. And this is the entrance. So once you get, uh, get out of 121, straight away you can come to this community.
you can see in this road there are lot of homes under construction i will try to show one uh, one or two constructing homes so you will get a rough idea of course this have multiple plans i will just show you how this home looks so the main plans aston woods have is artesian plan harmony plan uh, industrial and uh, luxe and minimalist and rockwell rose, rose belt timeless these are the multiple uh, uh, type of models uh, uh, we they have it you see here the the left side is all uh, new homes some of the ho homes are already sold and some of them are available all these homes seems to be available you can reach to the aston wood uh, sales representatives to get an idea of what is available so this is a back car garage they don't have the front car garage so is a, a back car garage you see that this is a very huge hall and this is a open kitchen and immediately beside to that uh, is what you will see the master bedroom here and this is uh, uh, the a uh, restroom which have the he and she rooms which is attached to the master bedroom this is the master bedroom once you step out the out of the master bedroom you immediately will see the kitchen here here you have the guest restroom and then this is the utility room so the moment you come out of the uh, car garage you immediately get into the utility room this is a art uh, artesian model so in the ground floor you see one bedroom now we are stepping into the first floor so this first floor uh, the moment you get in the, you see a huge uh, media uh, i mean i mean a game room this is a game room And then this side you can see one bedroom child bedroom this aston wood the construction is pretty good and uh, this is another bedroom which have the attached uh, restrooms so these two are using a, a zakenzil so both bedrooms uh, can utilize this uh, restroom and uh, this is uh, one more bedroom this 
this bedroom uh, have a common uh, full bath which can be used by anyone so the the restroom have a entrance from the hall as well as from the bedroom so in the in the in the first floor you have a three bedroom uh, with a hall no media room so this is a 2800 to 3000 square feet i think if you they will have an upgrade for the media room if you want a media room another 500 or 400 square feet uh, they will add so this is a very small lots so you will have a small uh, uh, patio not a big patio if you see that after patio there is no much space in the back as this is a back garage there is no back space so if anybody want to put any garden is just uh, side only and they have a mesh so hoa won't allow any wood uh, uh, walls is just a mesh you see besides also they have a mesh so this is one of the model but if you go to the ashton woods website it's uh, southern hills you can uh, see multiple models they also have a virtual tours as i said they have in the this street i have i think they have multiple brands artisan plant i have shown you i think they also have harmony and industrial and a couple of other uh, models so this is one of the other home i would like to show it to you guys this is one this more is a uh, two car garage austin same community at southern hills two car garage This is a two-car garage. So the moment you step in, uh, left side okay, you so see the a very big storage space. Garage, it comes underneath the steps. Storage so area. That space they place the very well by putting a storage space. Yeah, this is the garage. 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 and then in the left and immediately you can see the dining the area so you enter from the main uh, room so the main entrance this is after the garage and uh, this is the main room. entrance so the moment you enter you enter here, through a main so, entrance uh, right uh, side uh, immediately uh, left immediately, side immediately uh, you can see left uh, side um, you see one uh, guest bedroom guest bedroom this is the guest bedroom which have the attached the guest bedroom uh, and then it is well, here which have access have a full bath also but the entrance to this is uh, through the main this is a full bath and then there is a small storage area and here a small storage space and this is an another bedroom. and you have one more bedroom so the yes. moment you enter into the from uh, from main door you left so side so the moment you enter right side you do the one bedroom and uh, other bedroom both have the both the bedroom you use room. the common uh, restroom here so this is the hall now then here there is a place to hang the coat this coats. is a storage area and immediately you will have the right side uh, steps steps looking very steep steps are looking like steep and uh, and towards this is my the left dining area this is uh, the office the area event. this is office room and, and right I side this is uh, i don't know why they put a extended wall dining here. area this is and which an have the entrance from area. the kitchen you see Or that kind uh, of a partial open wall. wall so that is the entrance from the kitchen 
Here and this have a huge storage, storage space. space as well. And then this is a hall. So this is the hall, huge hall. And this is the kitchen. From the kitchen, straight away you have the entrance to the dining area. There's a huge hall. And they have so given a small, a small patio, patio here. They have it. A small patio. They have given a small patio. Yeah, this is the hall. One good thing here, mm. from and here, here kitchen, from you will have uh, an kitchen. Entrance they have given a walkway. Uh, the dining area. To the dining area section. And oppositely, you can so see. I feel the, they should have removed this wall. So this wall should be removed. So, so this Ashton models, I think they are using uh, every inch of the space as very well. Wall. So that might be a very good way. You see here. So if they remove this wall, entire wall, then the that uh, hall becomes so big. I don't know how they are going to use this space. I feel the dining area and hall should be clubbed together and so that here it can be very big to room. The, uh, so of this is a master room. bedroom. Dining area looks good, but uh, this is a master bedroom. Looks good. So this is a master bedroom, which have the huge uh, uh, restroom, as well as he and she room. With the uh, he and she room. So at the ground floor, you have two this bedrooms have a tower and then one here. master bedroom. So total and three bedrooms. Standing, we uh, have it. Two bedrooms uh, share one common bathroom, well. and this one have the attached. This have the there is a lot of standing. This is also uh, shower as well as tub. So this one have the master bedroom at the ground floor. Total and three two bedrooms, bedrooms uh, at the ground floor. At the ground floor. Maybe this room can be used as an yeah, office room. I will try to go to the first floor and show it to you. So this room can be used as an office room here. And then the opposite is the extended dining. This uh, what the dining. small change. Then two uh, bedrooms it should yeah. be good. If so the moment you move that wall and make it you as can a big see, hall. Uh, you go right. You can see two bedrooms here. Then come all the way straight. The left side you have the extended dining area. And then, uh, otherwise, said you have it looks very left kind of. Said you, know, you have like the closed one room. If they remove the walls, it become little open. Okay. So we'll go to the. So I'm now going into the uh, first floor. As uh, we have a three bedroom at uh, down floor, so we may not have many bedrooms at the. So this is a gaming area. So this is a game area. The game room. This have the full and bath. Which here. have the full bath here, with a standing uh, shower, and then one bed. And then one so bed. So in the top floor, you have only one bed. So basically, in the first floor, they have just a game room and then a bedroom. So ground floor, they have the three bedrooms, two bedrooms and then one master bedroom. Steps looking a little bit steep. That's what I feel. Okay, so this is it about the Ashton Woods home. Thank you so much for watching. Okay, so that's it for this community. So this community also have a couple of other parks. I will also try to show you guys the park and other areas in this community. You see here my uh, left side, that is uh, one of the park they have it. I think 
they are still and in the development. This is a so this is the right area. Table, the, this is a huge park. park. They have, I think, Seems. one or two parks. They have it. This is going to be a park. said that by seeing the trees you can tell how old this community is. This is a two or three years old community. You need to check which schools it comes. Couple of homes comes into the Frisco ISD. Couple of them will go to the Meccani ISD. Comes to the Meccani schools. So the back side you see that they are only providing the mesh, I think the HOA limitation or something. They don't have the wood uh, walls, it's all uh, the iron mesh. Majority of the homes are already sold and I have seen couple of homes for the resale as well and couple of them they have the new homes. The entire community you see this kind of circles and left side you can see the park. Uh, this is one of the main park they have it. As I said that I don't find any swimming pool or community hall but I have seen a couple of parks and walking trails. So you see this, this is a ch children's play area and then there is a walk base. Some of the roads are steep, it's not the plain one, so when walking it will be a little difficult if it have steep, for, but a couple of the roads it's uh, pretty flat. These models you see opposite they have so many windows. I think this is some of the models Ashton window where I have noticed it, it have so many windows. This is also one of the home constructing. I see most of them as a stone outside. I don't know the HOA fees. Uh, generally, Craig Ranch communities HOA fees will be little high. We need to check with the sales guys about the HOA. Thanks for watching. Thank you.